everybody's running and the world is getting so crazy. People work so hard, there's no time to be lazy. The weekend comes, I'm down with that. Grab your ball, grab your bat, head to the beach, grab some brains. Better hurry up, just got two days. Playing games, hanging out, going closer, then we're down. hair wax on your color, I deduce that you would like a large pepperoni pizza. Uh, that'll be fine. No pepperoni on my part. Quickly, Watson. The pie is afoot. Hey, it's Tino. So we were just talking about Chloe Montez's latest disaster. She got her head caught in a tuba, and the firemen had to use the jaws of life. Her ears totally folded up. The doctors say she has to wear a special orthopedic hat. I know it isn't funny, but <laughs> it is funny. <laughs> it's not as bad as the time she got trapped in the janitor's closet. Yeah, and she had to eat a mop to survive. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Chloe, laboring under the baleful weight of perennial calamity. <laughs> what? You lost this. There she goes, tishing again. <laughs> uh, tishing? Yeah, tishing. Like a verb, to tish. <laughs> <laughs> to tish. It's genius, Carver. That's what we can call it when Tish acts all smart and stuff. <laughs> I don't act smart. I am smart. Tino's smart, too, but he doesn't act like it. <laughs> right. Oh, wait, I don't, uh... What are you saying that I'm I I act stupid or blah? See how smart he doesn't act? Yeah, he hardly ever tishes. <laughs> <laughs> Not so loud. What if other people start saying it? Forget it. Yeah, that'll never happen. Fine. I shall remain stoic in the face of adversity, like Cleanthes or Marcus Aurelius. Tishing again! <laughs> <laughs> Tishing, huh? <laughs> you tish all the time, Ruby. Me? You're the tishiest tissue who ever tished a tish. <laughs> <laughs> Damper, popular in Australia, is toasted dough. Though rock hard, damper is quite tasty with jam, but not as tasty as the jam would be without the damper. Mmm. Actually, I find this crusty pseudo bread to be a gastronomic delight. You are so tishing. <laughs> Did you hear that? Look what you've done! It's spreading already! It's like... If I called Tino pumpkin pie, pretty soon everyone would be doing it. Don't sweat it. This kind of thing never catches on. You tell a pumpkin pie. Do not! Mr. Higginbotham, have you heard that new Jacques Nouvelle dulcimer piece yet? Oh, yes. It imbues one's soul with a scintillating nimbus of ethereal bliss. There I go, tishing again. <laughs> oh. Check it out. It's Coach Colson. And he's with some woman. Like, with her. Helen, the 
Crash of the Surf reminds me of nothing so much as the rush of corpuscles through the pounding ventricles of my love-struck heart. I love a man who's not afraid to show his tishy side. Ugh, is there anything more disturbing than seeing one of your teachers on a date? Yes, there is. I see Moon Mania as a metaphor for man's struggle against social entropy. Wow! Maximum tishage! Maximum tishage? You are one point from a high score. How could you blow it like that? I didn't blow it. You blew it. You guys all blew it. You came up with that stupid slang term, and now I'm gonna be the biggest laughing stock in Bahia Bay. Ah, you'll never be bigger than Chloe Montez. Maybe this is a good thing. If people like saying Tish so much, maybe they'll try to be extra smart just so they can say it. It could be a fantastic educational tool. Pumpkin pie is right. You are teetering on the precipice with that pumpkin pie thing, my friend. Precipice? Man, you are dishing the Tish. I'm going home before I say something I'll regret. Like what? Like you're a bunch of insensitive gutter snipes. She definitely would have regretted that. Oh, yeah. Good thing she didn't say it. Fine, I don't need them anyway. <laughs> President referred to the Speaker of the House's statements as tishing of the worst kind. <gasps> it's tish-tastic. Just tish it. With a tish rating of... You're watching the Ology Channel. Ah, oh, my favorite channel. A little geology or biology will do me some good. Welcome to Etymology Today, the show that examines the origins of words. Today's word is... Obi tish, obi tish, obi tish. Tish. <laughs> it is my opinion that tish is an acronym for tedious, intellectually superior haughtiness. <sighs> At least I don't think it has anything to do with me. I couldn't stand... I believe the word derives from tish katsu fracas. A 12-year-old girl in Bahia Bay, California. Colson and that woman are still in the exact same spot. It kind of grosses me out to see a teacher outside of school, like, having a life and stuff. Yeah, it's creepy. I like to think they just unplug them after school. I know exactly what you mean, pumpkin pie. Enough with the pumpkin pie! Man, it's like you're going, Tino, please put these chili fries down my pants. Okay, Tish should have been here half an hour ago. Maybe we should see if she's at home. She might still be cheesed off about the whole Tish thing. Oh, she's being too sensitive. I mean, it's not that annoying. Tishy, 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 woo, woo. Tishy, 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 woo, woo. Tishy, tishy. <laughs> it's that annoying. Woo, woo. Come on, Tish. We said we're sorry. What do you want us to do? You want us to cry? Because I'll go get an onion. I swear I will. I don't care what you do. You started this stupid Tish thing, and now I have to change my name or... Or something. I'm never speaking to you again. But Tish, we just go away. She's right. This is all our fault. There must be some way we can make it up to her. You can make it up to me by going away right now. Just go away.
Tishy, my little sweet bean. Petra Tishkovna, you should not be sad. You should be happy. This new word let all peoples know you big into lucky tool. Big into lucky tool? You mean big intellectual. Is what I say. But, Mama, it's insulting. No, no, no. Insulting is when you say breath is like back end of goat. Your friends would never say this, yes? They are liking you. I know, but I used to think they respected me. Now I just feel like they're laughing at me. Okay, no more mopings. Mama says it's time to fix this now. <laughs> I leave you to kitchen my cup. Kitchen my cup? Kiss and make up. Tish? We... Guys, I said I was never talking to you again. You don't have to talk. We just brought you some stuff. Remember this? It's my first A paper ever. You ought to remember it, because I never would have gotten this A without your tishing. This is my pool trophy. I couldn't have won it if you hadn't tished me up about how shooting pool is really just geometry. This is the issue of Outlaw Skater magazine with my editorial about backside airs. They never would have printed it if you hadn't tished up my grammar. Don't lose this. I only have 63 more copies. We just wanted to say we're sorry. Yeah. And even if you think the word tish is insulting, we think it's a compliment. We're really proud of you. And we're grateful for everything you've done for us. Well, that's it. We'll just go now. Don't go. Really? How can I stay mad at you when you're willing to get totally disgustingly mushy? I told you it was disgusting. So, you forgive us? I guess so. For was it not Alexander Pope who said, To err is human, to forgive divine. Yeah, I know. I'm tishing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do your final thought thing. Pumpkin pie. Well, I guess we'll be a little more careful about making fun of each other from now on. And maybe Tish will be a little less, you know, touchy. By the way, I have a feeling this Tish thing is going to go big time. In fact, let's find out through the magic of the Flash Forward. <laughs> is this the coolest or what? <laughs> Later days. <laughs>